I swear that dude took like freaking 5 or 6 turns. Craziness. Yo, welcome back to another episode of Raid Shadow Legends. As you all know, um, the three times Savage Gear event is coming soon. So I would like to take this opportunity to kickstart a series uh, that is uh, arena related content. I'll be doing um, videos based on my uh, daily arena farm because my great hall is still not complete and I do farm arena regularly so I think it's a good idea to um, showcase some of the teams that I fight or some of the, some of the teams that I would use right in goal 5 not really a plat level pusher all right because for me PvP is uh, another form of um, enjoyment all right rather than uh, putting uh, a lot of stress on my uh, myself to 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 do it all right during the reset so that's really not a, not a thing for me I what I'm what I like about arena is actually just to see what people are using and then um, and then think of how uh, the ways to counter it right so so this is a daily thing right I will be doing this regularly you may or may not learn a thing or two so if you are new to the game maybe you would learn something but if you are like old school in this game playing for years then maybe it's uh, a form of entertainment for you so why not right all right so let's do some fights all right i have a lot of tokens to spend let's see what kind of interesting teams that i can fight so normally you see a lot of uh, um, arbiter teams in go5 in their defense not sure why all right so this is my speed farm team that i use daily <laughs> or every time i do arena okay it's a full auto i think it's quite free to play friendly all right Okay, there we go boom done <laughs> okay how, how long did it took seven seconds okay they did not even take a turn okay so I'm not sure if the death knight is in uh, uh, stone skin but if it is then no big deal okay ah uh, man I mean, if you have a Baron, the fight becomes so short and there's a limit to how entertaining it can be, right? <laughs> right, so really not, re not really educational, just um, entertainment, purely entertainment. Okay, now we got ourselves a Hegemon team, right? So... Normally I would just go with the same speed team, but in terms of variation, uh, I'll just go like this maybe. Okay. If you have more to up, forget about using them just for defense, right? They can be used for offense as well, especially against warlord or Yumeiko teams. Uh oh. Wait, they have buffs, they have bombs? Oh no. I totally forgotten about War Mother. <laughs> <laughs> man, man, my mistake to use um, Stone Skin. Okay, my bad. Not going to edit it. I totally forgot about War Mother. So, okay. Uh, if they have a bomb champ. Okay, we got Python, no big deal. Okay, I just want to maybe control the, the clans. Okay, okay. 
Äh, okay. Going to die, no problem. Uh, we got three revivers in this com, so it's really not a big deal. Going to cleanse off. Okay. Totally forgotten the existence of War Mother. <laughs> oh man. Oh, there's a Lydia too. I'm starting to feel like I'm a noob or something. Oh man, okay, done. Okay. Alright, so let's find some Warlock teams. Uh, that's not really a Warlock team here. <clears throat> like, these kind of teams, we will just go with a straight nuke. Right? Don't really care how it is. Just gonna nuke them down, even if they have a war golf. Uh, Raiho might cleanse, not sure. Nope, did not get to cleanse. Okay, uh, this really boring to fight with. Taras! Alright, this would be a bit interesting. The new champion Taras! Okay. There's no cleanser. Good. So what I would do here... Okay. Okay. So this would, this would be what I would do. I'll put in a Raman too. Alright. To try to block off the passive of Mr. Teres. Alright, there's no cleanser in their team. Okay. Oops. I hate that fear, man. Okay. Are we good? If uh, Duchess is not dead, then she will be dead now. <laughs> Alright. No problem. If you revive, then I'll just kill them again. Okay, now we might have a problem. Taras regain. Okay, no problem. That Taras may not be well built. Not sure. If it's a well built Taras, I think uh, it's quite tanky. The passive makes him very tanky. Okay. So that's that. Interesting to see Taras. Uh, not sure how this team would work. I'll just nuke them down. Okay, speed teams. Why not, right? Fight some speed teams. Maybe instead of using my speed farm team, let, let's go old school, right? People just look down on Tormin. Okay. If you're new to the game and you have Tormin, and you're not fast enough, like all these whales, right? So... This is how you counter speed teams. Okay, no problem. See, everyone got frozen and stuff. Tormin as offense team. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we have ourselves a Nishak team. Normally I would just nuke this team down with the Baron, but if you don't have a Baron, then okay, you have the Python. Still, you can do it easily. Uh, let me see how can I. Okay, another team I would use. There are so many ways to beat this team, right? So, okay, uh, okay, okay. They also have Magnar. This is a very fun offense team to play with, right? You can stun, uh, you can like stun Duchess. It's so weird. The stun set is doing the job. Okay. We have blocked debuffs up, so Nishak is not going to land any bombs. Okay. Not gonna uh, try not to use Kaimar. I try not to use Kaimar because uh, Kaimar will just reset and <laughs> my Lyurus will get back the skill. But Leorius has two AoE, so it's all good. If you have a Leorius, try to use him. 
a very good nuker in the arena still. Okay. What are these teams, man? There are really not really a lot of teams in arena. So we have a bomb team, Raglin, Mithrala. Interesting to fight. So if I'm not using a fast CV team to block off all the bombs, what would I use? Mm. Bomb team. Like, let me also try to use Ronda, right? Ronda is a free login champion. Somehow, I rarely see her being showcased in arena. Not sure why. Uh, okay, let me. Let's save the view. Like, if that guy tries to throw some bombs, then I will just kill it. I'll just cleanse it. Okay, cool. Mitrala. So we block off all the debuffs. Easy. Right. Did not manage to showcase Ronda much, but... Uh, I'll try to use Ronda as much as possible. Okay. She's a really, really strong champion in the, in the arena. Okay. Like, I will not use her in a relentless gear. I will just use her in full on savage gear for Ronda. Oh, finally, we see ourselves. Uh, wait, let me collect. <clears throat> So let's go on with the Hegemon team, right? Normally, I would go with like a Necret or something. This is a team that I would normally use against Hegemon because it's a laid back team. It's a guaranteed win, no matter how you look at it. <laughs> right, it's really, really fun to watch. So, just taking this opportunity to showcase one of my offense teams. This is normally my uh, defense team. But it's fun to watch, right? This is all about entertainment, not so much on technicality. So, okay. Wait, everyone is dead? Hmm, okay. That's unfortunate. Try to find teams that are worth fighting. Where are all those Mortum Cup teams, right? <clears throat> so normally if you see like a Uko and Ultimate Death Knight defense team and then you have a Lady Kimi so you can you can use Lady Kimi but based on the team power I don't think they are in stone skin if they are ever in stone skin then I will just strip it okay okay they are in stone skin good but Uko is not in stone skin, right? So it's okay. Just nuke down. Reaction, okay, no problem. Reaction uh, accessory is like so cliche nowadays. It's so boring. It's kind of expected. Did not manage to strip uh, Death Knight. It's okay, like Death Knight is nothing when everyone else is dead. Just take your time and kill Death Knight. All good. That's how it is. Alright, so... There's that. Okay, so we finally found a Necrat team with more to my cup. So, teams like this, normally they are full stone skin on uh, Necrat and Mortu. So, just use like Lady Kimi with a Kaima. So if you have Lady Kimi, wait, Stone Skin not on Mortu but on Duchess, okay, cool, it's fine, no problem. Mm. Okay, no problem. 
If you don't manage to strip, but just it's okay, all good. That's what Kaimar is for. Marshall not doing much there. Now it's just uh, Duchess herself. Teams like this, it's really not a big deal. Okay. Easy. So don't be afraid about um, more to make up if you have uh, Kaimar and Lady Kimi. You can definitely use them. Okay, let's go against half frag. How should I go against half frag? The Kaima will most likely strip me. But we are strip proof, right? This is so good on Python. We are strip proof. I think. Right. Let's try. Okay. We got Duchess in stone skin. Okay, we got sl Python. Are you gonna protect us? Oh, nice! Look at that! Would you look at that? Um, Uko is going to steal all the buffs right here, if you see. Um, st stealing all the buffs, so Python passive will benefit Uko. He has a lot of damage mitigation from someone like a half frag. Easy. Look at that. There's nothing this team can do besides dying. Alright, that's how it should be. <laughs> okay. Just left with a Kaimar. Mm, easy win. That's some scary stuff from Python and Duchess combined. Halfrack does absolutely nothing. <laughs> okay. I have a feeling that this half rack is a well built one, if I'm not mistaken. So, normally teams like this, same story. I will just go with my trusty lady Kimmy because they have a candy phone. Ultimate Death Knight, most likely in stone skin. Easy. This is normally how I farm um, these kind of teams. At the point that is really boring. Candy Fawn on the leader spot will do nothing if they die. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So when everyone dies, it's just left with uh, the, the alternate ultimate death knight, which is really boring. It's only a matter of time. Okay. Okay. So, what do we have here? Lydia Krisk Okay Like if I'm not using CP in Lady Kimi's spot Then I will be using Lady Kimi for easy strip Right I'm not sure if this strategy is viable in plat level But It's very viable in go 5 <laughs> Alright Like If Duchess would revive Then I will just kill them again No problem the candy form will not take a turn. Easy. I mean, why would you even try to revive when you're just gonna die again? Right? Wait a minute! Who are you? Okay, now it's just the Duchess. And okay, we will make short work of this Duchess. Strip. Okay, done. That's normally how you would take out a team like this. So, okay. Okay, so let's go like this. Let's see if this would work. Interesting to fight a Python team. Stone skin Python, for sure. Okay, got sheep, no problem.
Whoa. Okay. So I think this would be the new current. Okay, no problem. Mm, Baron will just one shot through the passive. Not sure if that was the case. Okay. I need my Kaima back. This is very very annoying. Going to try to take down the Python. Very very tanky. It's another good showcase of how tanky a Python can be, right? Going to keep the A3 if try to revive, no problem. So I expected him to revive. Gonna keep the. Okay. Quite a long fight. So. This is one of the examples that you can use um, as a Python defense team. Pretty solid. I think the Python resistance is quite high. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's try a Mortum Cup team, right? So, normally, if I see teams like this with a Mortum Cup, I would just go with Lady Kimmy and Kaimar easy did not manage to strip it's okay so over here Duchess, Mitrala and Lydia already took a turn that means no reaction <laughs> right so we just left with this guy so it's really really boring to watch okay cool do we strip him now? Yes, thank you. Boom! More two team. Okay. Uh, uh, what else is fun to play with? Hmm. Like if you fight a Rotos team, all you need to do is just put in Ultimate Death Knight. <laughs> and be done. Let me let me just try to see what can I use in this team, right? Uh, so we got a cleanse. We got Leoris to kill everybody. Okay. All right. Don't need Uko. Because let's go like something like this, right? Maybe I'll use a faster. Duchess. Okay. Faster Duchess. Still in stone skin. A bit faster. Let's see here. Does absolutely nothing. They got only uh, Protoss as the, main, as the main damage dealer. So, not sure what that is going to accomplish. How many turns he's taking? Look at that. I swear that it's like 5-6 turns right there, man. <laughs> Alright. And then everyone dies. <laughs> oh man, that is always fun to watch. <laughs> always funny. I swear that dude took like freaking 5 or 6 turns. Craziness. Uh, Hegemon team. I mean... There are so many ways to deal with Hegemon. It's almost boring. Like, I got two Dwayne Johnsons in their Under Armour suits. Under Armour here means um, stone skin. Very durable. Built to last. Okay. Like, there are so many ways to deal with Hegemon. Uh, deal with Candy Phone. It's almost boring. 
Okay, we just go with Candy first. And then we go with the Reviver. And then, there's only two. I'm a, always a nice guy. If they want to go first, they can go first. Alright. I'm chilling. Not doing much. So, if you like to go first, you're welcome to go first. You know? So good. So, two dudes broke the arena of fans. This is what Raid has become. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh man, it's very really funny. But you can't use this kind of thing against uh, Kaimar. Kaimar would most likely strip you. So this meme probably won't work. <laughs> okay. Uh, like these kind of teams, it's easy job. Like you have two hegemons. I have two more twos, man. Take your pick. Okay, cool. Did not proc Pero, that's so sad, man. Come on. We are in Under Armour. Okay. Wait, did not even use Pero. Kill all the Hegemons, that's so sad. Alright, meme team against meme team. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Right, another ultimate death knight and Uko combined. There's no Tormin, so I can use uh, Lady Kimi. As if like they think they're all safe with all the stone skin going on. Damn, I did not manage to strip. <laughs> okay. Like if you try to revive, that's okay. I will kill them again. Uh, wait, let me save Duchess skill. Okay, cool. Because he's gonna try to strip me, right? So that is where you save your skill and then go back in. Okay. Stone skin will not work. <laughs> wow, look at this guy. <laughs> um, okay, this is a really fun team to play with. But I'll do you something better. Uh, okay, let's see if double ultimate death knight. Has got any use. Dude has two ultimate death knights, alright? So, we just kill Rotos in one hit because the passive uh, is blocked. Wait, I kill everybody in one hit? So, quality over quantity. Two ultimate death knights doesn't mean you would win the defense, alright? We finally found a warlock team. And what I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is gonna use these two duo. I named this team Under Armour because Stone Skin is like Under Armour. They like to put me into cooldown. So I'm a good guy. I always let them put me into cooldown. As long as they don't have a stripper, that's fine. Okay. Kill the Usaga. Going to kill Duchess. Alright. Oh. That's not good. Okay. I mean. 
if I'm the owner of this team, I'll probably get emotional damage. Emotional damage! <laughs> if I read the battle log, right? So, that's so sad. That's enough for today. My one day in arena series. So, if you like this content, please like and subscribe. And I'll do more of these um, arena fights in the future. So, stay tuned and I will see you on the next one.